In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the power steering pressure sensor on this Ford 500. You're going to locate this towards the back of the cradle underneath the car. Let's get into it. Underneath the vehicle, we're going to disconnect the connector. You're just going to push down on the tab. There's actually two tabs, one on both sides. Push those in and slide the connector up. Using a 15 millimeter wrench, you can get on the bottom of the sensor and loosen it up. Once you get it loose, you should be able to do it by hand. And it slides right up. I do have a drain bucket underneath because you're going to lose some fluid. Take the new sensor and get it started. wrench, snug that up, take the connector, and line it up, it only goes on one way, lock it down, take some brake parts cleaner and just clean up any of the residual. After you're done, if you replace the switch fairly quickly, you shouldn't have to add too much fluid, but you want to double check. Take the cap off and top off as needed. For the power steering fluid, you're going to use transmission fluid. It's Mercon. So double check your owner's manual just to be sure. Put the cap on and you're good to go. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.